I asked Jake, when did he realise Lakeisha was the one? His reply was, I always had a feeling in my left nut she was the one. <laughs> well, if that isn't straight out of a poetry book, I don't know what is. Jake and Lakeisha, you are adding to your life not only the affection of each other, but also the companionship and blessing of a deep trust. You're agreeing to share strength, responsibilities and love, not only for you, but to little Johnny also. Jake, I promise to support you through any decisions you make in this lifetime, even if sometimes it's with an eye roll or a tantrum. I promise to be loyal and faithful until death do us part. Keisha, I promise to hold your hand through the good times and hold you tight in the bad times. I promise to be loyal and faithful every day and to put you before all else. I promise to fill your life with laughter and love as we have done for the last six years. I will be there any time you need help spelling a sales ad on Marketplace and will always be ready to say yes when you want to buy a new toy. I promise that even when we are old and grey, I'll still make you the perfect cup of coffee. We will look back on our story together and have no regrets. From this day forward, you will never walk alone. I love you, Keisha. You, Jake, are my best friend and my most loyal supporter. From the day I first came to go shooting with you and met the whole family, to when you drove from one end of the state to the other to pick up my crippled body for my family birthday dinner. I cannot imagine loving anyone else. I can't wait to be your wife and hopefully grow old with you. April showers in the month of May The ground's still wet and the sky's still grey But you're still Cadences or chords to play No melodies or words to say But you're still singing And it keeps me breathing When I fall apart To a million pieces When I don't know where to start You put me back together To make this relationship work takes more than love. It takes compromise. Your hearts want only the best for each other. Patient to stay open to one another, to learn and grow even when it's difficult to do so. And it takes trust to go forward together without knowing what the future holds for you both. Lakeisha and Jake, you have come here today of your own free will and in the presence of family and friends have declared your love and commitment to each other. And by the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now share your first kiss as a married couple. Now, first of all, I'd like to say how, acknowledge how lovely the bride's looking tonight. We'll give a round of applause. There's one thing I know about Jake and Isha is they will always be there for you when you're in trouble, whether you're broke down the side of the road, or even away camping or <laughs> camping trip, and Keith is having a special nap, wakes up. <laughs> Because Bill's collarbone is sticking at his shoulder. Thanks, Jake. 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 Thanks,
here in your woman. Proud to call my daughter. When you fall apart. So I think I'd like everybody to be outstanding, please. To I'd like to both toast to the bride and groom. Mr. and Mrs. Giving, Gibbons, wishing you all the best for the future. I'm sure it will be happy and full of adventure. Put you back together. Thank you to all our friends and family that have made an effort to actually come up here. It's a fair bit of drive and we just hope that you all enjoy your meals and you enjoy your night and the memories that you make tonight. Um,